Hello, and welcome to the Foilist TV. I am proud to present my next analysis of the Rio Round of 64. This time, it's René Prons of Austria versus the man, myth, and legend himself, Guilherme Toldo of Brazil. This was a pretty long bout, so sorry for the wait. I put links in the description to both Fencer's Who's Who videos. Check them out if you haven't. Click the link in the description to watch the actual bout with my commentary, which I've hosted on Google Drive. Now, here's my analysis of the bout in general. So, this was the first bout of Toldo's emotional roller coaster of a run at Rio, and for many people, it was the first time seeing him fence. I would say he acquitted himself pretty well, but he wasn't really on fire just yet. Pranz proved to be a tough opponent for him, though I imagine Pranz would actually prove a tough opponent for pretty much anyone, so that's not really saying much. At the start of the bout, one thing became abundantly clear. Pranz tried to hit the flank, like, every time. Seriously, that guy was more of a flanker than an SU-27. Now, against an opposite-handed opponent, the flank is a very useful and very important line, but you shouldn't go for it to the exclusion of all else, especially if it's costing you touches. And in Prance's case, it was. Toldo caught on to him pretty much instantly, and though it took him a while to figure out the distance for both offense and defense, he was able to hit Prance pretty reliably and close out the flank with his arm. It wasn't until the second period that Prance realized that other parts of Toldo's lame actually existed, but when he did, he immediately found way more success. It wasn't just that he was hitting other lines, it was that by showing actions in other lines, he forced Toldo to slow down and stop robotically closing out the flank. And that made Prance's flank actions finally start to work reliably. The bout also slowed way down, as both fencers seemed to realize that closing in recklessly was getting pretty dangerous. So at this point, both fencers had a pretty good arsenal of working actions. Toldo had a solid attack and remis on the inside line. Prance had a nice parry for repose to deal with it. Pranz had a powerful long-range counterattack set up with an appel. Toldo had a really good counter time against it. Toldo had a counterattack with a closeout in 8, but Pranz could finish in preem pretty easily. Toldo had a counter post in preem as well, but Pranz had a bit more reach for a stop hit. None of these options are particularly conducive to getting close to your opponent, but in general, Toldo was doing better in the close distance situations. In the third period, Toldo made some weird short withheld attacks and Pranz started counterattacking but then Toldo switched back to close-in actions and won. It was a close bout, 15-14. I felt like Toldo had the upper hand tactically for most of the bout, although he kind of had to scramble in the second period when Pran started to change things up. This really could have gone either way, but given the way the rest of the event turned out, I'm really glad that Toldo won. We'll be seeing him again really soon. Thanks for watching, have a fantastic day, and as always, stay sharp.